18 Great Roses for Shady Gardens The Anthony Mayland rose is a deep, rich shade of yellow that does not fade and will glow in the shade. A pleasant, mild fragrance and a second bloom in late summer add to its appeal. Anthony Mayland is a bushy, mounded plant ideal for borders, hedges and as a mass planting. Dainty, five-petaled blooms of pink and white grow in clusters on this beloved hybrid musk shrub from 1937. This variety is praised for its disease resistance, fragrance, and shade tolerance. A ballerina can bloom well into the fall and has the bonus of attractive hips. It can also be trained as a beautiful small climber. A great shade tolerant rose is this 2000 All-America Rose Selection winner and 2004 American Rose Members Choice winner. This knockout rose, also known as Radraz, is incredibly disease resistant and easy growing. It is also drought tolerant, surviving and even thriving in the most devastating of dry summers, as well as the most humid summers. It is highly resistant to black spot. The cycle of bloom and growth is never-ending and provides a show of brightly colored cherry red blooms from early spring until frost. Marmalade Skies, an ever-blooming Floribunda and a 2001 All-America Rose Selections Award winner, is a tangerine blooming machine. Blooming will not be quite so abundant in partial shade, but it should not disappoint. This compact, ever-blooming plant is ideal for low borders, or as a specimen in any landscape. It blooms early summer through fall. Dark pink buds open to full, paler pink rosettes with a soft honey fragrance. Mary Rose, sometimes categorized as Rosa Osmary, Mary Rose, is a David Austin English rose and is a great repeat flowering, shade-tolerant, disease-resistant specimen. It makes a nice, bushy shrub with large, 4-5 to five inch blooms. Beautiful, disease-resistant and fragrant, New Dawn, is a near-perfect rose. New Dawn was inducted into the World Federation of Rose Society Hall of Fame in 1997. The double pink, fragrant flowers fade to soft pink and stay attractive for a long season. Expect New Dawn to bloom in the spring and again in late summer. It can be grown as a shrub or as a climbing rose. Passionate Kisses is the registered trademark name for a rose that is sometimes categorized by the official name of Rosa Meisbel. It is a relatively new rose that first attracted attention because of its provocative name. A continual blooming floribunda, Passionate Kisses, has salmon-colored blossoms that light up in part shade. This is a compact rose that is a good candidate for borders and containers. Some rosarians say this is the best shade-tolerant rose there is next to the knockout. Glossy green foliage offsets the large, orange-scarlet, semi-double blooms. Playboy's flowers pass through shades of yellow and orange on their way to the deep red of the fading blooms. A 1989 gold medal winner, the Playboy has very good disease resistance. Its heavy blooming and medium, rounded habit makes it a great rose in the border or landscape or planted as a hedge. It is sometimes known by another trademark named, Rosa Chirio. Seafoam is a floribunda first developed in 1963. It is used as mounting ground cover or landscape rose but can also be trained as a short climber. The persistent mass of white blooms gave rise to its name. It is extremely cold hardy and adaptable. Seafoam works great as an edger or in mass plantings. Zephyrin Druin is known as the thornless climber, making it not just beautiful, but easy to work with. Its canes can be easily trained and trellised. Deep cerise pink blooms and an old-fashioned rose fragrance have kept this bourbon climber growing in gardens for decades. Although it accommodates shade, it is prone to fungal problems in high humidity. Carefree Wonder is a shrub rose that lives up to its name, adapting to almost any conditions. While the blossoms are exceptional in appearance, the sheer quantity of flowers makes the bush a delight in any garden. Carefree Wonder, also known as a Maypitak rose, is a repeat bloomer with single blooms of pink with white reverse. Eden Climber is a large, old-fashioned looking rose with large, double blooms in pastel shades of pink, cream, and yellow. It has a pleasant scent and looks and smells wonderful along a fence. It is one of the most floriferous climbers, with equally attractive deep green foliage. 
This plan also goes by the name, Pierre de Ronsard or, Mayviolin. It is hard to beat hybrid rugosas for toughness and dependability. Also called Grutendorst roses, they are a classic, carefree grower. Small puckered, leathery leaves offset clusters of double, bright red blossoms. Although the original Grutendorst is red, it has produced varieties in pink and even white. They all make great specimen plants that can easily grow as tall as 6 feet. Rose cultivator David Austin scored again with the Fair Bianca, English Rose, also called, Asuka. Fair Bianca, has densely petaled pure white blooms with a spicy scent and packs all of the great features of David Austin roses, pest resistance, cold hardiness, and heat tolerance. It blooms heavily in midsummer and then sporadically through fall. Considered a modern climber, Golden Showers was named an All-American Rose Selection AAR's winner in 1957. Its name comes from the bright yellow blossoms that seem to flower continuously. With a honey-like fragrance, the blossoms make excellent cut flowers. This climber looks equally nice against walls or structures. This compact floribunda is covered with buds that open as clusters of salmon pink double flowers and fade to creamy white. It blooms profusely over a long period and does not seem to mind partial shade at all. A favorite since its 1909 introduction, Grussen Aachen, grows to about 2 feet wide by 1 to 2 feet tall, making it a nice choice for a border or hedge. Ice Mighty Land, also known as the Maven cultivar, is billed as the perfect rose for busy people. It is an easy care ground cover rose. While the early ground cover roses tended to be real sprawlers, this is a more civilized cultivar that is well behaved and also more pest resistant. Beautiful white, pom-pom shaped blossoms are shaded with a soft pink. Iceberg roses have long been the standard to which other floribundas are measured. Iceberg was inducted into the World Federation of Rose Society's Hall of Fame in 1983 and remains a garden classic. It lives up to the category Floribunda with lots of icy white buds that open into double rose blossoms. It is available as a shrub to 4 feet, standard, weeping standard, and climber to 12 feet. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more interesting videos. And please hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm.